it all comes down to one thing, one thing only, and that's love. Love everything you say, love everything you think, love everyone that you meet, love the people that you judge, love the fact that you judge them, and eventually that will cease. Love the nuances of how you have created your existence, of the people that you have brought forth into your world. <laughs> Love the chaos that is in the midst of your mind, for it has been part of your soul's journey of ascension, beloveds. You have brought forth the world as you know it, and that has been necessary. For in order for the creator to experience every nuance, every, every possible permutation of existence, you have been necessary. And everyone that you know and everyone that you love and everything that happens in your existence has been necessary. And it is all done in the name of love. And yes, there are circumstances and there are people and there are situations that you have judged. And that judgment has come from fear. And indeed, I have been practicing with Sohana Grace, she has been willing to listen more than usual, let us say. And we have been practicing sending love, emanating love, generating love to all beings and in all circumstances. Her internal love, she is using her, one of her platforms to do a daily recalling of what it is that she loves, what it is that she loves about herself, what it is that she loves about life. And so her focus, beloveds, has been on love. When you look for love, you will find it. When you think about love, you will find it. When you call forth love, it will come to you. Everything that you are, everything that you know, has the essence and the flavor of love. You have added <laughs> a little pepper of judgment. You have added a little garlic of fear. You have added the spices to what you call this primordial soup of your existence, beloveds. But understand that the fundamental essence of everything that there is about you in every way that you are generates and stems from a foundation of truth that is love and light that is the creator incarnate. <laughs> One moment, beloveds. Mm. Mm. this very world all of the worlds all of the existences that you exist in the different aspects of self so to speak beloved they are all the same tree that has roots that has limbs and branches and leaves that has a front of a leaf and the back of a leaf the shadow and the light and yet what is it that a tree does it provides the very oxygen that is necessary. Photosynthesis. A light comes into a leaf. Beloveds, you are an embodiment of the photosynthesis of love. Light comes into you and you transform it into love. You are these living, breathing creatures that bring forth love into the universe, into the world. Think of that. You are an enactment of nature. You have been created by love, through love, for love, and with love. It is the very embodiment of you. So look within your hearts, beloveds, and say, where do I find frustration? Where do I find judgment? Where do I find guilt? Where do I find shame? Where do I find pain? Where do I find illness? Where do I find symptoms and suddenly think the worst? None of it is the worst, beloved. It is all the best. If you knew that every single moment and everything that you do is as it was meant to be, for you to experience love, for you to say, ah, I find myself judging this thing that I have done, and all that you were ever meant to do is to love it, you would release instantly any judgments that you have cast upon yourself. If you can look at another and say, I think that they should be different than the way that they are. If only they did the things that I thought they should do or acted the way that I think they should act or spoke the way that I speak, that exists within your comfort zone, beloveds. And you are so much more than that. So look upon what it is within another 
that you would want to alter and to change and see if you can love it and embrace it instead. <laughs> For this is the way of a Christed being. This is the way of all beings. You are precious and you are loved beyond your capacity to comprehend from this vantage point. But as you bring yourselves to love, beloveds, and as you bring yourself to light, and as you bring yourself to truth, know that there are a multitude of beings that are here to assist you on your journey of transformation, of recognition, and of remembrance. Only love is real. Only love is real. Everything is love. Know that. I love you and I am with you always. And I will speak with you again. Blessings to you, brothers and sisters. Thank <sighs> you.